Just take a few golden rays, a simple solar panel, and a sleek modern design. The result? The world's first public solar-powered phone charger. Built in the Serbian town of Obrenovac, they call it the strawberry tree. And these students are the brains behind it. 16 wires charge different phone models. There's enough energy stored for a month if the sun disappears. They won a European energy prize in April, the youngest and only non-EU team taking part. We showed Europe that we have also something to offer, that young people in Serbia as well as in other developed countries can have original ideas. So I think that this was great uh, as well as for image of Serbia in Europe, as for the young people in Serbia to give the faith that they also can succeed in their ideas. So now the big test. I'm walking through town and I suddenly need to make an urgent phone call to my editors in London. There's a breaking news story. Unfortunately, my battery is running out. So I stumble upon the strawberry tree, come through, sit down on the nice comfortable bench, find the correct charger, plug it in, wait for 15 minutes for the sun to work its magic. While you sit, the hope is that you have lots of good thoughts about renewable energy. Well, that passed quickly, now for the result. And there you have it, a fully charged mobile phone. It's now had almost 20,000 charges since being built, with customers of every age. It's phenomenal, this lady says. We're very proud of it. It benefits us all. It's clean energy and useful when you have no other solution for your phone, he says. The seed of the strawberry tree idea was planted here at Belgrade University. The team perfected it through computer models over a period of three years. Modern technology using a natural resource, as the humble mobile is brought back to life with a bright idea from the sky. Mark Lowen, BBC News, Obrenovac, Serbia.